Minimizing the environmental impact of our cars is a priority for Audi. Some of our diesel models use a Selective Catalytic Reduction System, or SCR, which requires an additive called AdBlue in order to achieve current and future environmental regulations. On a car which requires AdBlue, the liquid is injected into the exhaust gases. The AdBlue additive breaks down the nitrogen oxide gases to produce water vapour and nitrogen. It's important not to let your vehicle run out of AdBlue. If it runs out, the engine will not start. When levels get low, a warning message will be displayed on the driver's information system. This will calculate how many miles of AdBlue your vehicle has left. Topping up the AdBlue can be done at your local Audi centre, or you can do it yourself quickly and easily. 1.89 litre AdBlue top-up bottles with an easy fill connection can be purchased from any Audi centre. You can also purchase 5 or 10 litre versions, which require an additional adapter to connect to your car. The AdBlue cap is located next to the diesel cap, and there are two types, depending on the model of your Audi. One version, which can be removed by hand, or this version, which requires the car's wheel wrench to open it. Remove the spare wheel from the boot and use the car's wheel wrench to undo the AdBlue cap. Simply screw the bottle onto the AdBlue valve and push down to release the fluid. Once the bottle is empty, release it, which closes the valve. You can then unscrew the bottle and remove it. You will have to put a minimum of 5.7 litres of AdBlue into the car for the warning light to go out. Your car's AdBlue tank capacity can be found in the owner's manual, and we recommend you always read the label before filling. If you are in any doubt about AdBlue or SCR systems, then please contact your local Audi centre.